When one is avoiding the attention of Sherlock Holmes, one learns to be discreet, hence this place. Her leg must be hurting you. Sit down. I don't want to sit down. You don't seem very afraid. You don't seem very frightening. <laughs> yes. The bravery of the soldier. Bravery is by far the kindest word for stupidity, don't you think? What is your connection to Sherlock Holmes? I don't have one. I barely know him. I met him yesterday. Mm, and since yesterday, you've moved in with him, and now you're solving crimes together. Might we expect a happy announcement by the end of the week? Who are you? An interested party. Interested in Sherlock? Why? I I'm guessing you're not friends. You've met him. How many friends do you imagine he has? I'm the closest thing to a friend that Sherlock Holmes is capable of having. And what's that? An enemy. An enemy? In his mind, certainly. If you were to ask him, he'd probably say his arch enemy. He does love to be dramatic. Well, thank God you're above all that. I hope I'm not distracting you. Not distracting me at all. Do you plan to continue your association with Sherlock Holmes? Uh, I could be wrong, but I think that's none of your business. It could be. You really couldn't. If you do move into, um... 221 B Baker Street, I'd be happy to pay you a meaningful sum of money on a regular basis to ease your way. Why? because you're not a wealthy man. In exchange for what? Information. Nothing indiscreet, nothing you'd feel uncomfortable with. Just tell me what he's up to. Why? I worry about him constantly. It's nice of you. But I would prefer for various reasons that my concern go unmentioned. We have what you might call a difficult relationship. No. I haven't mentioned a figure. Don't bother. <laughs> You're very loyal, very quickly. No, I'm not. I'm just not interested. <laughs>